I'm a SOTC5 and this is a very quick account update uh, video. There's not a lo whole lot of new news because I have a whole lot of stuff I said in my last account update that I was going to review and haven't got to yet. But there's a few um, things I want to um, tell you about. One is that there was a coin I did not show you in my um, money collection because it's not mine. It's my brother's. And since it was my brothers, I felt that I needed to ask permission before I show it to you. But it is by far one of the prettiest and most interesting coins that um, uh, we have in our collection. And it is the Chinese Panda coin. I know you can't see that that well, those three bolts. But um, anyways, I'm going to have a um, slideshow video um, that has a lot of my interesting uh, coins and um, notes and it's going to be a slideshow so you can hopefully get a better look at uh, my collection anyways this is the silver uh, panda coin it says on the front um, one ounce AG which for y'all who don't know y'all's um, periodic table AG is the um, element si symbol for, or the periodic symbol for silver, and AU is gold. And um, let's see, I should have a annotation right there. That um, explains a little bit about the periodic symbol AG. Um, but anyways, that is it, and you want to continue reading the, um, the little annotation, just pause it. Otherwise, I want to get up to um, some somewhat news, if you will, uh, with the case sod buster that I've told you many times I'm going to do the review in both Spanish and German. I'm not fluent in either language, but I do know a little bit. And I'm still learning. Um, I, I kind of um, ran into a speed bump on the Spanish language. Um, I didn't see this coming, but there was actually um, different dialects of Spanish. And I guess the um, best way to describe it is kind of like how um, in English, um, English kind of changes when you um, from Britain to Canada and the U.S. Um, there's just certain words that um, they say differently. For example, um, in Britain, I don't know about um, Canada, instead of flashlight, they say torch. And um, it's just stuff like that. But anyways, there's different dialects of Spanish, and you know, those, I guess what you would call proper Spanish. Um, kind of like how we have proper English and then you have like the Mexican Spanish which has like different slang words and then you have um, like the Spaniel Spanish that has their own different slang uh, Puerto Rican and um, all the other Spanish speaking countries have their own slang for different words but um, I didn't realize this and when I was learning um, Spanish there was a phrase that I was studying um, it comes razor sharp out of the box and I believe um, if I remember this correctly from my translator it's es de gran latidas de la caja and um, so anyways um, I talked to um, one of my Spanish friends you've met him before uh, he's the guy who maced me with the pebble spray and he's also made it in uh, both of my spawn videos and um, I said well, I want to know if I'm pronouncing this right. And I said it to him, and he said, Well, the only word that I really... He said, Well, first of all, what are you trying to say? And I said, It comes razor sharp out of the box. And he says, That sounds different. The only word I really recognize is box. And I showed it to him on my translator, and I played it for him, because the translator will say it in Spanish to you. And I played it for him, and he says, Yeah, that just sounds different. Sounds weird. So anyways, um... I went to college and I found just about the rest of my Spanish speaking friends 
that I know um, at my college, and I asked them, they all said the same thing. It sounds different, but I do recognize the word box. So anyways, I'm going to have to try to find the um, Spanish-speaking teacher at AC. I haven't been able to find her. Um, I've looked for her, but for some reason, I guess her schedules don't quite meet just right. So anyways, I'm going to talk to her, see if she can ex help me out on one of the more, uh, maybe give me the most commonly understood Spanish dialect. Or I'm probably just going to end up doing it in the proper Spanish and... You know, everybody ought to understand a little bit of it. But anyway, so that was just kind of a little um, um, speed bump I met while studying Spanish for this review. I don't know if um, the German language has any different dialects, but um, yeah, but I'm going to just use the translator to learn that. And that's just about it, as far as news goes. Um, Fox season's over with, so I'm going to try cranking out as much videos as possible and uh, still try to keep them somewhat high quality and uh, that's it I'm Satsu5 and um, that's, that's it I'm out <laughs>